Hey guys, this is Jason Lanier here in Maui, Hawaii. I have the beautiful Kristen Melchor, aka Nitzirk. Uh, I call her that because that's her Instagram name, Nitzirk Melchor. Make sure to look her up. And I am gonna, um, I'm filming this today on the A7S II in 4K video, so uh, I hope you guys enjoy the 4K. I am doing uh, a solution for you guys today, trying to provide solutions for you. Ever since I released the video on high speed sync for, um, with using the monolight that I did in Australia, I had questions of what other lights could we use. And so uh, I am using today uh, the A7R2 with the Pixel King adapt uh, triggers, the high speed triggers. Um, and I'm gonna be using it with the uh, Sony HVL F60M flash. That's about the five, $600 flash. Now some of you may be saying, well, wait a minute, the Rove light is less money and it's more powerful. That's true. But a lot of folks already have speed lights. So I'm trying to show solutions that work with the speed lights now. First thing you have to do on the Sony cameras is um, turn it to wireless mode. So make sure that the flash is in wireless mode like you see there. Okay? And you're good to go. The next thing you do is make sure that your Sony flash, uh, at least on for Sony, I don't know about other cameras, it, it's in high speed sync. It'll automatically pick up high speed sync as you see here, the HSS, it'll automatically pick that up when it's um, when it notices that the camera is synced on a high-speed sync trigger, or when the camera is set above a certain shutter speed that exceeds the flash sync speed. You go into here in the menu, and you make sure that it is in manual mode, and then it will fire. The only caveat to all this is it's only going to fire at full one-to-one -one power output, so you have to be mindful of that. Keep one thing in mind as well. It's only going to, um, on Sony's, it's on, on the Sony flashes, they only work in high speed sync if this part's turned down. So it's cool that we have the quick bounce, which you see here, but I wish that Sony would make it to where we could hold them out like this and have high speed sync. So hopefully Sony will do that sometime. Um, will this work on other Sony uh, capable HSS flashes? I would imagine it would. Um, I don't know, I haven't tested them. If anybody wants to send me something to test, I'd be happy to do it. I've tested Nissans, um, they work, but the new Nissans, but the, uh, the consistency in the firing of the flash is very poor. I, I found that to be the case uh, when I use somebody's in Australia and when I use somebody's over in Oahu in Hawaii. So I'm not too impressed with the Nissans uh, just for the firing. They just don't fire consistently and it's not a recycle speed issue. It's they just misfire, they don't fire, so. But uh, but if you guys have something you want me to test, send me a loaner and I'll test it and send it back, I don't care. Uh, I, I suppose I could try this on an Icon Flash, maybe I'll do that in another video, I don't know if it'll work, but we'll see. Um, but this is how it works on the Sony, I'm gonna share it with you guys. So I'm using the Sony A7R2 with the 16 to 35 FE Zeiss today.
shoot some. Uh, I realized what I was, how that must have looked in the camera. I'm sorry. Um, now I'm. Uh, we're gonna shoot some along the ocean here. Um, I will try to keep the monopod away from my body. wraps that up guys uh, a few housekeeping details if you want to use the pixel king triggers you need to have this adapter okay this is the sony adapter this is what you're going to need to to attach the pixel king because it's the old minolta mount which sucks so now they have the new universal mount which is great for everyone so in order to get the minolta mount to work with this you have to have the sony adapter like 15 20 dollars no big deal this is the ADP-MAA, the ADP-MAA. So that's for that. And then it'll enable you to put, to put this part onto the camera, lock it in. And now the Pixel King just goes right in just like that. Now this one is different. This is the ADP-AMA. This takes the Pixel King, the Minolta mount, and enables you to attach a hot shoe with the universal mount on top. So there's the ADP-MMA and the ADP-AMA. So it just depends on which way you need it. So guys, I hope this has helped. A big thanks to Kristen Melchor for being my model. She's awesome. And thanks to you guys for watching. I really appreciate it. Uh, just find the right gear that works for you. I hope you've enjoyed this 4K video off the A7S II. I would imagine it's uh, going to be pretty awesome. And uh, I thank you guys for watching. So until next time, keep shooting, never give up on your dreams. Find the right gear that works for you. If there's any gear you want me to try out, you can send, send me something on a loaner. Send it on over, guys. I'll try it out. Uh, never give up on those dreams. And remember, you only have one chance to get it right. Talk to you later. Bye. Oh, don't forget to subscribe. Muchas gracias. Fabulous. You guys still here? Hello? Talking to you. Hey guys, if you want to learn online with me, go to patreon.com slash Photography, and you will be able to continue this craziness online from anywhere on planet Earth with me. If you want to join me live, go to jasonlinear.com slash workshops, and you'll get to see me in my full glory live and in person, guys. I think there's a smudge on there. Is that it? Yeah, I got it. Talk to you later, guys. Bye.